matter, founder and president, and is advocating for and protecting and stop the desecration of the Flatbush Avenue burial ground and burial ground nationwide. Hi, we're very lucky to have Harry. Yes, and I also um, stand before, sit before you <laughs> as, a, as clergy. Uh, my name is uh, Chaplain Harriet L. Hines. I'm underneath the um, Healing Hearts Chaplaincy, uh, underneath Chief Apostle Dr. Kim Best. And I just want to say a, a brief prayer out here today. Please bow our heads in prayer. Spirit of the living God, fall afresh on us. Spirit of the living God, fall afresh on us. We stand here today and share our voices and presence as one city rising against violent crime in our neighborhoods, in our city, and in our nation. We pray today on this holiday, at this holiday season for the victims and their families that have to endure missing the presence of their loved ones during this holiday season. We miss them every day, but this is the time when we definitely feel it the most. I also want to send a prayer out as one city rising for our new elected official, especially our mayor in office, Mayor-elect Eric Adams, that God please anoint his mind, his tongue, and his spirit to make the right decisions as it pertains to violent crimes in this city. We know that as people, we tend to feel that the officials are the true authority here on earth as it pertains to the governance of us as a people. But I'm here to tell you that God is the true authority on this earth. He is the Alpha, He is the Omega. We are everything with Him, but we are nothing without Him. When we are at our lowest, He is our hope. When we are at our darkest, He is our light. When we are at our weakest, he is our strength, and when we are at our saddest, He is our comfort. And God, I ask you today to be the comforter here for all of us who are mourning the deaths of our loved ones. And again, one city rising, we need to come together as one city to rise against this gun violence and to rise against all violent crimes, stabbings, everything. I pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Also, I stand here before you uh, as the family of a victim of gun violence. Uh, in May of 2021, my cousin Shalimar Burkett was shot in the head while at a prayer vigil. Only she was there mourning the death of her friend who only died 11 hours prior to her being there and being shot in the head by drive-by shooters. To this day, we still don't know who did the crime. It has not been solved. Fortunately, the crime has been solved for her friend who she was uh, at the vigil with, but her crime has not been solved. And on this holiday season, we miss her dearly. There's no replacing her, you know? So, and I'm quite sure everyone here can relate to what I'm saying. We need to, again, we need to stand together as one city rising. May Eric Adams be able to solve here on earth, you know, what any other, what no other mayor has been able to solve. Thank you. Yeah.